guys, welcome back. I'm gonna see, oops, sorry. I'm gonna see if I can put my camera there. Yay, okay, cool. Um, Welcome back to a new vlog. I am so excited for this vlog. I cannot stand it. This is gonna be the first part of, this is gonna be the first vlog in my moving series. Sorry, I can't speak. But I just got off work. It's 4.45 right now and I just pulled up to Target. So, I'm off to a good start. I've had a really good day today, actually. I feel very cute today, like my little float. Oh my gosh, okay, calm down. I need to go in that. But um, yeah, I just pulled up to Target. So this vlog's gonna be a lot of like prepping, packing, um, cleaning. I really need to get in my house and like clean up all the sawdust. That's something that I wanted to do last week, but everything was just crazy so it's something that I'm gonna have to do tonight hopefully or maybe tomorrow I'm probably gonna have to go a couple times and like really clean everything really good um so I have to do that I have to buy a few things that I need like I have a list on my phone of things that I want to get in general but I came to Target just to see if I could find any of these things um so I put a shower curtain I might buy some of those bins like for my closet to organize stuff, but I'm not really like dead set on that. I, one thing that I really don't want to do in this whole process, but specifically like right now, but generally like I don't want to just buy a bunch of random things to decorate. I'm not really a big knickknack type of person. I don't like things sitting out. That's not really like the vibe I'm going for. So I'm not really here to look for like decor but more of just like things that I truly need for the house. Like I need a shower curtain. I was gonna get some bins for the closets and stuff to organize, but honestly, I feel like that's something that I, I'll see if I actually need once I get there. I don't wanna buy a bunch of stuff beforehand and then be like, I don't need any of this. Like I'm trying to keep the clutter and I'm trying to keep just all the, the stuff that I bring over there very, very minimum because it's a really small house. There is a lot of closets, but like I just don't wanna have a bunch of stuff. So that's that. Um, I also have like bowls, plates. Like I was thinking if I could find like a set. I don't have any like bowls, plates, cups. I don't have silverware. I have none of that. The only thing that I do have is my aunt has a really nice pot and pan set. It's the same one that my mom has. It's just like silver and black pots and pans. They're really nice. My mom's had them for years and my aunt also has those. They're basically brand spanking new pots and pans. They're just in a bin in my garage right now. So anyways, I do have that. And then I also want to buy or I want to look for curtains and a curtain rod for the, I want to put curtains in the living room and my bedroom. So I need curtain rods for that and curtains. But I also found some curtains on Amazon that I might like. I'm just not really sure. You know what I mean? I'm not sure. And then also lamps. I don't have any lamps. So I might need to get a lamp or two from Target. Um, and then, yeah, that's pretty much all I have on the list. Oh, I also want to put on this list rug for bathroom like you know just like a rug to put beside the shower when i step out of the bathroom or when i step out of the shower you know for the bathroom so that is my goal right now that is my goal for today and hopefully i can get over there tonight to start cleaning and like really cleaning the windows really good sweeping mopping hopefully i can do that tonight but like just at some point this week we'll be fine today is um Sorry, I feel like I'm on one right now. I feel like I've just like, feel like I've chugged a bunch of caffeine, but I actually have not. Um, today's August 30th. It is Tuesday. I took off from work on Friday. So I have off obviously Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then Monday's Labor Day. So I will have a four day weekend, which is like, oh, it's gonna be so amazing. So this is the perfect weekend to move. I worked last weekend. Like I could have been moved honestly for a couple weekends, but it just has not, been right but this weekend just feels very right I feel like I don't have to rush I really don't want to rush like last weekend I had to work all day Sunday we had to go to a game on Saturday night like a Carolina game and it's just like I didn't want to rush so now I feel like I'll have this whole weekend to move in and I'll have this whole week leading up to moving in to like prepare um I'm also going to clean out my closet hopefully in this video and like pack up all my stuff from my closet because 
God knows I do not need to bring everything that I own to the house. I need to like donate a lot of clothes or something or sell some clothes. So anyway, let's go ahead. I'm going to go into Target. I actually need to move my car a little closer to the front because I am parked very far back and I am not trying to walk. So honestly, cross your fingers and let's hope that I have some luck in Target because you honestly never know with Target. This is the first time in my life that I have ever actually gotten a car in Target. Literally never once have I gotten a car in Target. But I am currently looking at the comforters. This is not something that I came in here looking to buy, but of course I'm just looking for fun. But I might possibly need a new comforter. And this one's really nice. I really like the aesthetic of like a big thick comforter. So I don't know if I need like a duvet insert and or a duvet and then have like two inserts so it's like super thick and like a cloud so i don't know i just honestly i like how this is not completely white it's more of like an off-white like a beige i don't know i think that's really pretty i also like these colors like that's really pretty but that just looks kind of flat so which i know it's a technically a quilt so i don't know if i need a duvet and then get a couple of inserts if that would be a good idea to have like a really thick like have that really thick cloud bed illusion see this rug is really nice for the bathroom that feels really good i like that and i like how it's not gray i hate gray just like just so y'all know i hate gray I hate gray things. And my room is currently gray in my house, in my parents' house. I hate gray. <laughs> so I like this. Should I get this? I'm scared. There's also like this type of bath mat that is really cute. This is just like a really thin. Wait, this is actually cute. See the material is just like super thin. I decided to get two of the small size of that bath rug. And I feel like it's coming up kind of like gray on camera, but this is actually the gray one So you can see the color difference. So this is like more of a beige, which I really like and I really like the grip on the bottom Also got This shower curtain. I only needed one shower curtain because I already have one from when I was in college But this is what this one looks like. It's honestly really pretty. I like this a lot um, so I got that. I found two sets of these little curtains, which I really like these. So I'm going to get those. And then for the curtain rods, I can't decide if I like this better or if I like the little ball better. I don't know. And then I also got these little curtain clip rings because let me show you all this picture. I cannot decide what I like better. Like if I like this vibe better of like the actual clip with the little chain situation like it's clipped to the curtain or if i like this better where the curtain's just on the rod i feel like that's obviously way easier but for some reason i kind of like the look of that so i'm just gonna get those and if they don't work i can always bring them back and then i'll just bring back whichever pole doesn't work but the curtains kind of a 10 out of 10 i think this little chair could potentially be cute for the kitchen. So I'm about to sit on it because it's $110 and I need to test this out because I want to make sure I'm making a right purchase potentially because I have no chairs for my kitchen. Okay. No, it's a no already. Oh, ain't it hurts? Nope. It's like mm -mm, itchy. It's really cute though. Tell me that isn't cute. It's just, it kind of hurts, it's itchy. It's like, I'm definitely gonna get a splinter. And also, it just feels like cheap to me. It feels plasticky. Dang, that kind of sucks, that was really cute. But like, $110 for one chair? Absolutely not. I just looked at these little side tables. Um, like that one and that one I think are both really cute and I'm not saying I'm against them because I really want to I don't want to here's my dilemma I don't want to buy items for my house that are 
just gonna be like for the time being to fill space like I'd literally rather sit in an empty house than have furniture that I actually don't like but at the same time I don't want to order like expensive quality pieces even though I know they're gonna be quality because I'm not gonna live here for the rest of my life I don't know how long I'm gonna be living here like if it's for the next year two years like I don't know or if it's like for the next ten years but I just don't want to spend like a bunch of money at like Restoration Hardware or like Pottery Barn or somewhere that has like really nice furniture. I don't even know. If like, if I'm not going to be here forever and then whenever I move it, whenever I like get married or whatever, I don't know what I'm going to need and what I'm not going to need. So you see what I'm saying? That's kind of the issue right now. I just don't want to buy stuff just to buy stuff. So... Oh, lamps. Yay, I need lamps. I don't want a floor lamp, I don't think. So let's go to the lamp section. I've never bought this much stuff in Target in my life. I kid you not. Like, ever. I'm about to spin an arm and a leg. But I did need this stuff. Okay, this is cute. This lamp is cute. It's blue. <gasps> Stop. Wait, those are not the same. They're different color blues. But honestly, like... A blue lamp is really really pretty especially to add some color and some life back into the house because I have a lot of neutrals right now which I'm not like I mean I like neutrals but I'm not like dead set on everything neutral but these are really pretty these look really beachy the shades are pretty oh, I like these but they're not the same color like this is a darker blue than that okay I'm definitely getting these or at least one of them Look at all the fall stuff. Ah, I'm so excited. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Look at all this. <gasps> Look at the little pumpkins. These are cute. Wait, I know I said I don't like a bunch of crap sitting around, but do I need these? $10. Oh my gosh, those are cute. Fall's literally my favorite season. Maybe I'll do a separate vlog, like decorating for fall once I'm in there. I need to focus. That is also very beautiful very very beautiful love that and i also don't have um bathroom mirrors so i was looking at these and honestly they're not hitting like none of these are hitting i could do like a circle mirror i was thinking black originally because i have gold in the bathroom but honestly i'm not sure that i have the width I would just need to go and measure and then I also kind of was into this mirror it's just like a square, basic like square mirror with that but I'm just not sure I really need to measure so that I'm not just buying something that's wrong um, and I also got this lamp this is the one I chose like the lighter color one but the shades messed up so I got this shade but I'm gonna tell them like I don't want to buy this shade I just want to like switch them I wonder if they'll let me do that I don't know but this lamp is like $60 and it's messed up so I'm not gonna pay $60 and then this is 20 like I'm not doing that so I just hope that they'll let me switch it like I don't want to be that person and be like a Karen I'm definitely not trying to do that but at the same time I don't want to buy something that's messed up you know what I mean been over here cleaning for about an hour and I feel like I have not gotten much done I have been in every single cabinet and drawer and I've cleaned and like wiped every cabinet and drawer out I did ask the dude like hello where's the cabinet <laughs> so he's gonna come tomorrow and put it on I don't even know where it went but I have wiped out every cabinet really well all the drawers have been wiped out um the windowsill was cleaned and like that is taking me forever i'm like completely out of breath um i cleaned like all this basically like all the surfaces and like inside and let me show y'all how dirty this floor is like sawdust everywhere you probably can't even tell on camera but like it just looks like it is ashy like it needs some lotion so so you can kind of tell like it's just it needs to be swept 
You can tell over here it needs to be swept, it needs to be mopped. And, and I also have this little tool um, right here, like this little thing that I literally wipe down with just like a dry pad. I wipe down literally every part of the wall, like any sawdust that was like on the wall. I wipe down all the walls in the kitchen and this wall. Now the only thing basically that's left to do in here is to sweep. And then I'll come in here and do this. But anyway, that's the progress. That's what I'm doing right now. this cold brew so I'm so glad I remembered because I did not want to have to buy a coffee today so it's very nice and convenient that I have this here um but today is Friday I took off from work today I'm gonna finish up like how cute is this coat but I'm gonna finish up like cleaning the house y'all saw last night that I started to clean I basically got through the kitchen and the living room and today i really want to get through like the hallway the bathrooms the bedrooms and then that should be pretty much it for the cleaning and then i also want to run to i look so rough right now i literally woke up and showered but i need to wash my hair but the reason i don't want to wash it yet is because i'm going to go back to the house today and clean a little bit more so I don't want to get all sweaty after I just washed my hair like I'd rather just wash it tonight so anyway that's that coffee is looking good but anyway I also want to run to a different target than the one I went to at the beginning of this vlog because the one I went to at the beginning of this vlog they did not have a lot of a lot of different stuff that I was looking for. Like I need another set of curtains because apparently, you know, I got two I got two curtains, but I thought within the packet they would have like either side, but they don't. So I need to go get another set of curtains. I need to get a lamp. I really wanted to get that little blue lamp. I thought it was really cute, but they obviously didn't have the one that was right. And then also while I'm like around a different area at the other at a different target I was just gonna see if they had any other little home stores or anything like that so yeah that's the plan today and then after all that is done I'm gonna come home and like officially start packing up my closet packing up my room and my bathroom and then tomorrow will be moving day so i'm very excited also oh yeah let me show y'all i ordered a rug from rugs usa and it came so i'm excited this is what it looks like i did open like this little part this is what it looks like it's a jute rug but it has these little white strands on it which makes it a little bit softer than like a normal jute rug so hopefully it fits I really wanted like a really really big rug to fit like the whole perim not the whole perimeter of the room but I wanted it to be like pretty big still so um, anyway we'll go tomorrow and obviously put it in whenever I officially move in but I'm gonna take y'all with me throughout today I'm gonna make some breakfast I got these little mini bagels and some cream cheese and I'm probably gonna put some strawberries on them and then I'm gonna make some eggs so That'll be good. And I also, look at this. I literally burned my wrist on the oven. So that's amazing. Ross, let me ask you a question. All jokes aside, where is this relationship going? 
Come on. Back through because I've been I decided I'm gonna go ahead and knock out cleaning the rest of the house before I go to town and figure out like what I'm gonna buy and stuff but all of this stuff was left over from like the paint or something but it was all sitting on the fireplace and so I moved that last night and I like wiped down the entire fireplace and like obviously like wiped down all the walls and stuff so I gotta figure out what to do with that I don't want to put it outside because I'm scared someone's gonna steal it but anyway I gotta figure out what to do with that um but everything in the kitchen is pretty much clean I'm probably gonna go over like all of the exterior of the cabinets and stuff again and then I really need to mop today as well I'm probably gonna re-sweep and mop in like these two rooms but as far as the hallway back I haven't done any of that so my goal right now is to finish like sweeping and wiping down all the walls all the doors all the cabinets the bathrooms like cleaning out the cabinets and drawers and then like sweeping everything and then mopping so I'm probably not gonna be able to get it all done right now but I will be coming back probably at some point oh I was like where's my coffee I think I left it in the car because I made another coffee <laughs> it's so weird living in a town now rather than living in the country because like there's people like there's a guy across the road like weed eating his yard or doing something I don't even know speaking of having like neighbors now and like living in a town let me put this up here I've got to tell y'all what happened to me last night so I was in here last night it was like around sunset and I just was not thinking about locking my doors for some reason like I was just in here and I was going in and out dumping this bucket that I have to clean with and I didn't think about locking the door each time I came inside and so I'm in the living room like cleaning and all of a sudden I hear the door open and someone goes hello like a man and I was like hello like what do you mean like you're in my house like I was so confused I, I round the corner I was so scared because it was literally almost dark and like there was a man in my house he did not even knock he just like walks in and so I turned the corner and I was like hello what are you doing and he was like um is this house for sale I was like no this is my house and he was like oh well I guess you beat me to it and I was like huh, like what is what is happening right now I was so scared so anyway that was like really scary so now every time I come in this house I will be locking the door like immediately because that was just a really scary thing but anyway I'm going to go ahead and start I don't want to waste any more time while I'm here Guess where I am? I'm in Home Goods. Look at all this cute fall stuff. I love it. Today has been the most exhausting day. I literally have been at my house cleaning all night and it's now midnight I just got home and like took a shower but I've been cleaning all day my feet hurt every inch of that house is spotless I wanted to show y'all a little bit of the progress I've made with packing I have this whole little thing filled up with clothes I have this little thing filled up with clothes and I left all of the clothes on the hanger because I feel like it's just gonna be easier just to take it right out of the box put it on the little hanger thing you know what I'm saying I just feel like it's gonna make my life easier in the in the long run so anyway that is pretty much it i'm gonna wait for my hair to dry and then i'm gonna go to bed but thank y'all for watching and i will see y'all when i move bye